The Guided by Prayer.com daily devotional for today comes from Isaiah 25 verse 1. It reads, Lord, you are my God. I will exalt you and praise your name. For in perfect faithfulness, you have done wonderful things. Things planned long ago. Isaiah was a prophet in the Old Testament, and his scripture is often quoted throughout the New Testament. Isaiah's prophecies and writings not only speak to the Israelites' redemption from exile, but his prophecies speak truth to modern-day Christians about the redemption that can be found in Jesus Christ. While there are many things that we can praise God for, one in particular is God's faithfulness in carrying out His plans. Isaiah chapter 25 gives a warning of the great day of judgment, the tribulation to come when God will pour out His wrath on the sinful world. Isaiah begins with the verse above to show that those who follow Jesus will bow to their knees during this terrible tribulation and will give praise to God for His faithfulness. Isaiah chapter 25 holds many praises to God for His deliverance of the Jewish people. It also gives hope to Christians as it speaks of God's vengeance. Throughout the entire chapter, one truth that cannot be denied and deserves full praise is that God is the one who delivers His people. No one else can be praised or take credit for the things that God alone is capable of doing. As we do not know when the day of judgment is to come, take this verse as an encouragement to always find yourself following Jesus and not to slip into the ways of the sinful world around us. Despite the tribulations you face, trust in God's Word, fall to your knees in prayer, and lift your hands in praise and worship, for God is faithful and He will carry out His plans. On days when you feel discouraged by the evil and sinfulness of the broken world we live in, turn to Isaiah 25 for encouragement. God has a plan, and He is coming to redeem His people, look forward to that day. If you are not yet a Christian, this chapter needs to be a warning to you. Come to know Jesus today so that you will not perish like the nations that have perished before you. Closing with our prayer. God. Today and every day let me exalt your name. Let me praise you for the things you have already done and for your plans you will carry out. Lord help me to find encouragement in your word and to hold true to your promise that you will return to destroy this world and redeem us. In Jesus' name. Amen. This has been another daily devotional from guidedbyprayer.com. Thank you for listening. Have a blessed day. You can find a link to today's devotional in the description below. You will also be able to sign up for email notifications by clicking the link.